Hey guys, 22 Plinkster here. <laughs> it has been a while since I did a video with the 500 Smith & Wesson. A lot of you guys have asked in the comments below of these videos to shoot through car tires. Now right here, I have five car tires. Now these are used car tires, but they still have pretty good tread on them. So put in the comments below, how many car tires do you think a 500 Smith & Wesson will go through? <music> All right, guys, if you haven't put it in the comments below, how many car tires do you think a 500 Smith & Wesson to go through? Put it down there now. Now we'll be using some federal uh, 325 grain Swift A-frames for this shot. Whew. All right, here we go. Let's let this dog bark. <laughs> All right, let's go take a look. How many car tires do you think that 500 Smith & Wesson went through? Now, just for the video's sake, and for you guys to know this, that thing did not knock me back. The 500 did not knock me backwards. I was standing awkward, so yeah, I'm sticking with that anyway. So <laughs> you may notice it took, made me take a step back. I wasn't, it's been a while since I shot that. I really wasn't prepared. So through the first tire, it went, here's the exit right here. It went out. So it went completely through one. I'm glad I can hurry up and did this shot or I can get these tires off my range and put them somewhere where I want them. All right, and here's the second shot. It went completely through the second tire. So that is actually four layers. If I'm doing my Tennessee math right, that's four layers it went through. Right here, went through this tire and came out this end. So there's three complete tires it went through. So that is six layers. Now you gotta remember these tires have belts in them and everything else, so it's just not rubber. And here's the fourth tire right there. And it did not go through the fourth tire. So you can see, I don't know if you can see this right here or not, right inside, but right there is where it actually went in the fourth tire and bounced out. So I thought it may have been laying in the bottom there, of that tire, but it was not. So if you guessed that the 500 Smith & Wesson went through three tires and into the fourth, congratulations, you guessed right. Thank you very much for watching guys. Until next time, y'all be safe and keep plinking. Hey guys, 22 Plinkster, and today I want to talk about one of my favorite sponsors. Hey bud, um, what you doing? You said you wanted to talk about SDI. At the we can talk about SDI, but you're wearing my giddy up. Uh-huh. Um, uh, hat, give me the hat, come on. All right. I don't have much air left. Glasses, give me the glasses. Okay. And no, 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 you keep the shirt, please. This is a uh, family-oriented program. Okay, all right, well, make sure you check out SDI.edu if you want to learn more about firearms.